Hello everyone, and today I am going to show you my collection of records that I got throughout the month. Why was the talking exception? No, not the exact one of the month. See, it's my birthday soon, and it's a bit messy because I've been building a lot of Lego, but it's been basically... Basically, my birthday is coming up on the 23rd, so that's it. Basically, is that I will be doing a quick little update, which I because I did do one less than a month ago and it's been very successful. See, so let's start. M most of these are the second drop of records of day, you know, RSD 2020, okay, because of you know, SARS. So let's uh, open this up to show you and um, I'm just going to that for now but let's start with the records that I want now, that's it the alternative rumours and I'm stretching my camera so yeah so this is alternative takes um, and remixes remixes from songs from Fleetwood Mac's rumours now as a plot twist, I don't actually own it on vinyl, but he is. But my dad owns it on. I own it on CD. So yeah, let's include some alternative demos and demo shape. And there's the record. There's nothing much, but this is. But this is limited to sixteen thousand copies. Now obviously that's bigger compared to like for other things, but like, I feel kind of glad I have something exclusive. Hey, that's not the archive to play which I'm seeing for my birthday. Sneak peek. Okay, so, yeah. Next, we have my, the, Paul the McCartney Half Speed Master, Master, I would just, this is a, just like the old scoop you find on Japanese records. Okay, so we have the iconic cover and the back cover. Now, if you watch this channel and you're familiar saying, hey, I recognize this album, it's because this, well, except if you don't, if you're from my private Rainmaker's History 1 video, this is actually my ha my most viewed video, meaning that if you are watching this on the channel, you've probably seen this album before. Yeah. So, this is a new half-speed remaster of it. Yeah, we have the pictures on the side, which... I can't remember if I actually showed the, the inside. This is an easier one, and look, it's the round cover! <laughs> yeah, so, you might be noticing I've been getting less Beatles thing here, so... Recently, as I'm going into new artists, but... Yeah, this is... But I will be picking one like this up every now and then, so, yeah. And you actually... And, again, I did have instant karma. Oh, and guess what? In Black Friday, they announced the Black Friday releases. There's a My Sweet Law. There's a My Sweet Law single. If they're going to release a ring, a ring of thing for the April 2021, that would be ironic and hilarious. Ha <laughs> ha. Nothing much about the record. I have no sticker. Not much to say about this one, except it has been remastered. Oh, look, it's the Standing Sun cover. Wow, I'm getting a lot of McCartney covers from a McCartney album. To me, in fact, again, I do only archive one of them. Okay. Next, we have the Wall Live in Berlin, which now, if you have watched this channel, you might not know, but basically, you this is not one of my, this is a less popular one, but I love Pink Floyd recently. Actually, following from the Beatles, they're kind of close now. Might even actually take their position. I wouldn't be surprised if they actually will. Hi, so nobody wants to say that. Because I feel a bit of daft after years of loving the Beatles, but man, yeah, but it's a live Berlin, and this is one of the most attended concerts ever. Through it, look at that, look at that. Now this is was just after the Berlin Wall fell in 1989. 19, yeah, I'm like this slave. I want to show you them. So we have, what I think. That is not the infrequent pick. I don't know what this is. And we have, um, we have Chaka's thing and Roger himself. And we have, I think that's Scorpions. 
That's members of the band. I think that's Brian Adams. Hello! As we look to side two. This is this. Now the school teacher as well as um, yeah, found the man there. Oh, um, about this COVID thing. I don't think he's a COVID. -y. I just think that he is. I think he's just thought that he doesn't want a lot of lockdown. I think that's Roger from the Scorpions. Okay, got the running order and who's playing it. And so basically, the difference in this and the album is now if you've got been to um um if you. Uh, and I haven't, but if you've seen Roger Walters performing with Wall in Soto or the original Wall tour, this has nothing to do with his tour, you would know that they've added in two new songs to it. Um, the song, I forgot what it's called, but basically it's that, what shall we do, oh yeah, that's something, what shall we do now? That song is basically an expansion of Empty Spaces, but which was left out. Eventually he added an instrument and also technically he cast some songs from the final cut and his solo, his solo album the pros and cons and exciting which obviously I'm well, never sure the cover of to you because you know but also they added in his solo song the tide is turning which is after line aka after live eight and this is cool you want to see what color this is it's white rhino yes 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 and that's my Who's shouting? Yeah, so we have like Brian Adams, the band, um, Van Morrison, and, and um, Johnny Mitchell. So, yeah. And, okay, so after that, we have this too. So I so what kind of abuse? I have not gotten the new one. John Lennon compilation yet. Because I own all his songs and I don't really care about the remix, but but I did order also them. This was after it came out. It came out earlier than I expected. So the Blu-ray, which I watched on Friday and it's called right. So basically this is basically a show about um it's it's kind of promoting show which includes the controversial pigs, you know with the Donald Trump imagery, which was used in an anti-capacity, to and that led into people bowing and even walking out the stage. So this is like, yeah, and it's like very interesting, I'd say. And do 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 yeah, but I'm not going to do that. You get songs from Dark Side of the Moon. You get songs from the Wall, and you get songs. From the, we get songs from Wish You Were Here. We got songs from Amnos. What from Meadow? Also, we have songs from the latest album. Is this what life we want? As, yeah. And on the record, this one thing you don't have comes being numb and yeah, smell of roses. I don't know what that song is. That's the encore. So, yeah, great album. And if you're a fan of Pink Floyd, or just a or heck, even Roger Walters or Office, pick this up immediately. And heck, maybe if you're just into uh, progressive music of the 70s, buy this. It's it's amazing. And also, I haven't got the wall one yet because, you know, I have this, I have the Live in Berlin, and obviously I have the original album. But yeah, so a bit of Roger Walters. Now, this thing is my dad's, but we bought it about the same time. R.A.M. Automatic for the People 25th Anniversary Deluxe Edition, which doesn't come with a record. Yeah, this is just a stitch. So it includes the a remix, the original album, a concert, demos, which is my best car, I feel, hey, wait. The bonus tracks. And then we have like music videos. And then we have, and then we have the uh, other four. Like a four, like a five point one mix of the album. So we have a um, book, which is basically uh, just a sticker, and then we kind of we pull this, 
Yeah, I'm gonna listen to the song yet, but I mean, it's okay. He loves it. So yeah, remember to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. It's not too hard. And share this video and comment on what album I should get. Really, it shouldn't just be Bon Jovi's and ACDC's new album. You shouldn't be commenting that all the time. Comment something that is already out. Okay, goodbye.